Same thing that happened when I became a GM or went into a bigger store. You can't do it all yourself and you have to rely even more on your people. And you have to, it's all getting things done through others. Right now, it's like trying to repair an engine on an airplane mid-flight because we're trying to scale up so fast, so quickly, and it's so much excitement. And there's so, um, there's, there's a lot of positive things going on, especially with AccuTrade, with the vehicle acquisitions, it's a real hot sector. But to make sure that we have enough, I don't know, infrastructure, make sure we're not building a house on, a, on top of sand, that we got sure. a strong foundation. And it takes a lot of discipline. It's how we did digital retail and the digital or digital transformation in the service department at the Toyota store. Yeah. Because you got to say no to a lot of things that you want to say yes to and that everybody's pushing you on because everything, you know, everybody thinks that one thing, they're, the thing that affects them is the most important. So trying to prioritize and be able to explain to them the big picture of what the common goal is. And if we, you want us to do this, we're going to have to remove this. So yeah. of all, or all these things, which one should we remove to replace that with? Yeah. And they always look at it and well, not, none of that, that's all critically important. Hello, everyone. I wanted to tell you about a workshop we're holding at NADA 2023. We're covering how EV adoption rates will impact fixed operations in the future. We'll show you real and meaningful data that might just put you at ease. Or maybe not, you'll have to come see. Come join us at our workshop, How Electric Vehicles Will Change Fixed Operations. We'll see you there.